Hello guys, Brian here again with another fragrance review. And I recently got a discovery set in the mail. And it is from a new company that I just recently heard about on Facebook. It's called 1454 Fragrance Company. And uh, they have 10 fragrances. I think they're named from like 1 to 10. So they don't have fancy names or anything. But they have 10 different fragrances. So I went ahead and got uh, the discovery set in the mail. So I think what I'm going to do is just uh, review each one of these in order and just see how I feel about them. Uh, so that should keep me busy on my channel for quite some time, maybe a couple months or so. Um, we'll see how that goes. This one is called uh, Perfume Blend Number 1. It's just a 1.5 ml sample. And uh, I believe it's part of their Fresh collection. And the top notes are uh, Calabrian Bergamot. Citron and Sicilian Orange, middle notes of Ceylon Cinnamon, Nigerian Ginger, and Tunisian Neroli, and in the base, Chinese Black Tea, Ambroxan, Gaiac Wood, and Alibinum. So, uh, right off the bat, you do get a lot of citrus here, a little bit of that Neroli feel that uh, I'm sure a lot of people are familiar with by now, um, but some other citrus is in there, Citron, Bergamot orange so a nice well-rounded citrus feel uh, i don't really think i get much in the way of cinnamon or ginger here so if you're looking for like a dior um sport or uh paco raban one million kind of a vibe you're not really going to get that here but what i do pick up on in the base or as it starts to settle in a little bit is that chinese black tea note so that gives it an interesting twist, something that uh, might be new to many people. Sort of meditative, calming, you know, just sort of different. Um, herbal, maybe? So yeah, it's a pleasant a surprise to have that Chinese black tea note there in the base. Um, so yeah, this one's a, a pretty good one, in my opinion. Uh, I'm not sure if I'm blown away by it, so that I would rush out and buy it. But certainly, if you're looking for a good spring, summer fresh fragrance this one's not too bad check it out and see what you think especially if you can get the discovery set like i did for a low price um let's get into my final scores on this one the smell i'm gonna say seven out of ten nice smell uh i was hoping the ginger would be a little bit more pronounced but uh unfortunately it wasn't but the, the black tea note did sort of uh, surprise me a little bit uh projection longevity I'm going to say it's sort of a soft feel, even after you first apply it. It doesn't really, like, hit you with a heavy cloud. It's just sort of a moderate projecting fragrance. We'll say 3 or 5 hours, 7 out of 10 there. Uniqueness, I'm going to say 7.5 out of 10. I think the Chinese black tea note does give it a unique twist. Not super unique. I mean, it's still something that I think most people would find pleasant and not too unusual. But enough of a twist that you might want to consider at least checking it out. Price point, 100 ml bottles are $109. I think that's across the entire line. Uh, so for me, overall, 7 out of 10. A pleasant citrus fresh fragrance for spring and summer with a little bit of a light Chinese black tea note in there to give it a different kind of a twist. Slightly herbal, meditative, calming in the background. You might enjoy that. Uh, so, yeah, check it out. 1454 Fragrance Company. This is uh, their number one. Thanks for watching. I'll talk to you guys later.